Hi, Teresa Momber here from craftingtheweb.blogspot.com with another card making tutorial for you. To begin, cut and emboss white cardstock using the largest die template from Spellbinders labels 32 nestabilities. With the cardstock still in the die template, sponge light blue ink along one side. Switch to a teal blue ink and begin sponging from the other side of the die template, working your way down until you've reached the light blue ink. Switching to an even darker teal blue ink, begin sponging from the top, working your way down, but not quite as far as you did on the previous color. Next, switch to a navy blue ink and sponge just along the very top of the die template. Using a snowflake from the Let It Snow stamp set, stamp the image using Versamark ink. Sprinkle white embossing powder over the stamped image, remove the excess embossing powder, and then use your heat tool to heat emboss the image. After embossing, use a medium gray Copic marker to add a drop shadow on the left side of the image. Switch to a lighter gray Copic marker and then continue on building up the shadow all the way around the image. Using Faber-Castell's opaque white pen, add little dots all around the background. Prepare a four and a quarter by five and a half inch navy blue card base. Position a Spellbinders A2 Matting Basics A die template on the card base and hold in place using repositionable tape. Using the die template as a guide, use the big white pen to draw a frame on the inside of the die template. Reposition the tape to the inside of the die template and use the pen to draw along the outside for a larger frame. Use 
using the Happy Holidays sentiment, also from the Let It Snow stamp set. Stamp the image on a thin strip of white cardstock using navy blue ink. Remove the die template from the card base and use adhesive foam squares to secure the labels layer to your card base. Then, use more adhesive foam squares to secure the sentiment layer to the card. For one final touch, add a self-adhesive gem to the center of the snowflake. And that completes my card. Thanks for watching.